Hi, so at the beginning of the year, 2016, I sat down, wrote some goals down, and really thought about it. I even started my goals at the beginning, at the end of 2015. And then looking at 2015's goals, I came down to two goals for 2016. These two goals have been to get closer to God through meditation. And the second goal is to grow and get to a rooted leadership status with Advocare. Now, uh, it's all, we're almost headed towards a 90 day mark of going down with 25% done with the year. And the good news is there has been growth in both of those areas. The Advocare team has grown, there's been a rookie bonus, there's been some new teammates at the team. Even for some of you watching this here, some new teammates have joined your Advocare team. And still, I wanted to take some moment to talk about commitment. Commitment and what it is and what it's not. Challenge and the challenges that prevent us from being committed and acting with that commitment. Uh, in my own family, uh, there's been a death in the family. And then, um, so also even in one of my uh, teammates' family, there was a death holding him back, stopping a little bit of our growth in our video production and, and stuff like that. Time change, spring break, and on and on. So, well, there was a lot of momentum built up the first 60, 70 days, and then there was a little bit of a, a roadblock that, that came, okay? So, I wanted to take some moments to talk about the mindset as to how to actually stay committed and what happens now, okay? So I see the first, this first quarter of the year as really just a warm up. Uh, really just a warm up, the setting of a tone, the foundation of a tone. Uh, because let's say myself, I've been working out for 18 years. I see that as, yeah, a, a big, big step in the right direction. And I never stop to ask myself, what would I do if today was day one? And, and what I've seen with commitment is, if we embrace it, any goal as fine, you've done what you've done, you have done what you haven't done. If we look at it, what would I do if today was day one? If you take a step forward in, in that direction and start from there, what you have done is gonna make that day one a lot stronger. And what you haven't done, let that go and recommit today. So a lot of people ignore the importance of commitment and wanted to take some time and make a quick video on how to commit, the mindset of commitment. Talking about some of the stuff that holds us back. And you yourself might have things like finances, maybe someone's, someone in your family's giving you a hard time, or whatever your goal is. And uh, you know, you're gonna have to clear away the plates, get your mindset in, in order, and recommit. What if today, Day one. I'm Jacob Adams. If the video helped you out, or if you have a friend that might help out, share it and have a good day.